When we're logged into Flipgrid with our educator account, we're primarily viewing the features of our educator admin or dashboard, including groups and topics from the teacher perspective. But did you know that you can open a group and you can actually view the student perspective of the group by simply clicking on the join code. Now, when I click the join code for this particular group, remember that I set up the privacy for student email. That means that I have to join this particular group with either my Google email or my Microsoft email. In ECSD or Edmonton Catholic Schools, our email address works for both. So I'm simply going to click join with Google and select my ECSD email. Now, here I am inside the group. Notice that I can see that join code and if I click it, I can actually enlarge it for my students. This is perfect if I'm modeling for my students in class and I have this up on the smart board. Notice that I can also click right here to record a response, but I'm going to scroll down to see what else I can see. Notice that I'm currently inside the first topic, design your locker, but I can see that there are two topics. This is the picker bar here. If I click on this bar, it will expand and I can switch to the next topic by simply clicking on the name of that topic. Once it loads, I can see the written instructions for this topic prompt. I can also see that a PowerPoint attachment has been included and if I click on that, it will open in a new tab. Since it is a collaborative slides activity, I could go ahead and pick my slide and build my All About Me slide following the instructions on slide two. Let's go back to Flipgrid. Now, before I click record a response, I want you to notice this blue button here. This is for immersive reader. If I click on this, I open this topic prompt inside of immersive reader and I have the ability to have this topic read out loud to me. For more information about Immersive Reader and other accessibility features built into Flipgrid, please make sure you check the Accessibility Features section on our MTech Flipgrid Resource Center website. Let's go back to the topic. When I'm ready to record a response, notice all the different places that I can click to record my response. I can simply come down to the very bottom and I can click on the recorder icon and this will launch the Flipgrid recorder. Now let's scroll up for a minute. Let's switch the topic to the first topic, design your locker. I want you to notice that this particular topic is moderated. So that means that if I click the record button now and I record a response, it's not going to appear here inside the topic. Only my teacher will be able to see my response.